So, stepped away for a little bit. Let's see if anything set on fire. Doesn't look like it. Okay, so this area is accessible, and this area is going well. We got the wall light up, so I can actually put the assembler back down. And I guess... Let's get two more of these. I'm not entirely sure how this works, but I'm pretty sure if a character is working in the dark, they actually have, like, a lower success rate. So it seems like a better idea to just kind of fill that out. Okay. So this area is pretty comfortable. Main problem is um, maybe these will actually provide a lot more. Well, do we want to... How many... How many hull blocks do I have? I got a decent amount. We don't have a whole lot of tech blocks. Should be okay. We got a ton of fuel. So, I guess we just kind of kick back for a certain amount of time. Because, yeah, solar panels are nice, but they just don't really have the power that I'm looking, looking for in a build. So I guess we wait, we salvage. We're almost done. It's just the infra scrap that's going to take a little while. So if I take a look at this, that requires some tech. That requires some of the high tech stuff, I think. Tech block and energy blocks. Okay. So I should be able to get the consoles. No, we're going to need we're going to need tech blocks up the wazoo. All right. That's fine, and Shell is delivered upon me last of her pizza because she cannot finish it. Shell can never finish her pizza, and that's okay. So what's the assembler need? Oh. Oh, there's the advanced assembler. So we need two more tech block to get this, and we do not have enough space for it. Okay. Hmm. Well, I wonder if I have just enough room. Because what I'd like to do is have no oxygen in here. I do not want to connect them. I guess we could get rid of the bathroom. That wouldn't be the end of the world. Just move that around. I mean, one way or another, we do not have enough to make the advanced assembler. One thing I'm glad about with this is it doesn't have the ONI style uh, heat, just like sustaining heat. So if you have a structure in a, in a vacuum, it just will not produce heat, which is nice because in ONI, they would just overheat like crazy. I'm sure they're gonna change that at some point. It really does not like that. It sucks. I guess we could move the assembler around. I'm just going to leave it there, I think, for the time being. So I think my best option, at least for the time being... is either to wait? I mean, we want to wait. We want to get the uh, the last of the whole scrap and the infra scrap out of that. Uh, 
Let's see. So if we go back to this. Oh, that gives us a lot more. A lot more potential options here. really like that customization option set up. That looks a lot better. So we can use this specifically to change, like, the look and feel of, uh, of the whole ship if I wanted to. So... I think I'm going to have to re redesign this a little bit. Some things are just a little bit too large. I guess the easiest answer would be to extend this further down this direction. And that's probably going to be what I do. Because I got the space for it. Cost me most of my hull blocks, but that'll give me enough space that I can get this down. We're definitely going to need another... Uh, hyperdrive, but like we don't need that until we leave this system. So actually, in that case, let's cancel. Let's cancel all of this. Main reason being, as much as I'd like the advanced assembler and as much as I'd like to fix the unreachable areas, we don't need to worry about that right now. We need to be able to leave. So let's go back to this system. We're going to need a hyperdrive. But I need some tech blocks. So I guess I'm just going to wait on that one for a little while. Luckily, we have at least enough scrap to make those. But I think we might have to buy some. need tech blocks because we're going to need tech blocks and we're going to need not those oh boy where's that fire fire is fine So we are going to need a lot of resources. Let me check. How far are we from done? I guess one option we do have is scrap all of this. It wouldn't be the worst idea in the world. We are actually starting to run a little low on water. What are we doing on ice? Yeah, no. That's a little bit of a spook. Oh, also, totally forgot, but thank you, OIC, OIC, M, uh, C Ram Quattro, for the however much resub. It really does not show me any of these things. I apologize. Eight months resub. There we go. Thanks for all the content. Enjoy my prime sub again. Sub again. Yeah. Have a good night. Okay. So yeah, I think my plan is going to be harvest as har harvest uh process as much as I can, but we should probably finish with this thing. Are they both done? Yeah, they're both done. Okay. Wait, really? Oh, there's one more bit of rubble. I have zero clue what we use rubble for. But apparently we have some amount of it. Can I actually make anything out of rubble? Oh. Wait. Did, t did the tools facility have that cost? Hmm. 
No. So that's where at least some of my blocks of my infra blocks have been going. Okay. Seriously though, is there a use for rubble? Not a well overwhelmingly. So let's go back to this. We don't want to transfer any of that. Okay, so let's let's bail. This place is boring. We've already been there, we've already been there. We did that whole loop. Okay, unpause. Alright, so let's go back here. Go back here. Alright, so we're going to want to drop out of hyperspace. I think we'll be fine. I think we'll have enough stuff. I bet if I undo some of these things, I might even be able to... I might even be able to trade for some of it. So let's let's see what the swan has. They got super blocks. That's not what I need. Well. I guess I'll get what I can in all of these. And if we can't get enough, then we just harvest what I can. Uh, vacuum up. I, I guess this is one option. Is I could actually go for the full redesign on this room. Just by dismantling everything I've got and then rebuilding those hyper, be hyper beds. I was hoping for another derelict, but yeah, well. I guess the one nice kind of flip side here is we do actually have enough noble metals and whatnot. So if we if we were to refine all of these down to what I need. Uh, let's see. I'm just going to set these to continuous. I should have a whole bunch. Oh, that's why we're not making anything. Because the recycler actually got reset here. I'm going to leave the soft scrap as it is, though. I don't think we have a whole lot of ice. Okay, we don't have any. Okay. So that'll, that'll give us slightly more, as long as it actually gets done. Because, yeah, tech scrap will give us infra blocks. Energy scrap will give us infra blocks. Okay, so that's less of a, less of a good thing that I was hoping for, but it's fine. Let's see, if I run into any bugs, does the game feel like it plays smoothly? There's a couple of, like, I'm going to say oversights that still need to be kind of fixed? The, uh, I don't know. There's small things, but it's small things. Otherwise, this game, you could tell me this game is 1.0 and I'd be like, that's a little lacking on content, but okay. Luckily, there's no air in there, so fires are kind of not bad. But yeah, grand scheme of things, if if you're a big, like, Dwarf Fortress, RimWorld, ONI fan, this will fit right in and feel right at home. I end up with a lot of electronics components. I've got a is it advanced assembler. Oh, we need optro. Op yeah. So if I wanted to make those, we need chemicals. We need a lot of these things. 
think we did need to trade. I'll make the most of it. I think we're just going to process what we've got here. Warp to the next location. And then probably, yeah, actually just tear everything up. Because we can tear up the solar panels. They're not going to be that helpful. We could potentially tear up the power capacity nodes. I don't actually need know if we need two whole stabilizers. We probably do. And then, yeah, we cut our mass as much as possible because we're just above. And I bet if we get rid of some of these machines, we might be able to get our mass back back down below, especially if we uh, if we cannibalize some of that space. Because there's no reason why I need to be this ship when going interstellar. I can I can pare down a little bit. See, is it too expensive to make more thrusters? Yeah. So to make another one of these, I need two... Uh, I think that's tech scrap. Like, every single one of these needs power and tech scrap. And I've used almost all of them on the fabrication room. Which is good, I guess. Because we want to have a fabrication room. I'm going to drop out of hyperspace for a second. See, how much will the game cost? I actually truly have no idea. Okay, so we don't have any other resources, so I think for now, let's just gobble. See, I bet if we gobble this entire thing up, bring it down to its bare minimum. Our mass is, I think, still too big, but that's understandable. So we'll just have to cut this space down. Let's see, even if you dismantle, you still have the mass and the materials. I mean, that makes sense. Thinking of the price of $24.99 on the Steam Forum page. That seems very reasonable for what this is. Especially if they add in cool stuff like mod support sooner than later. Completed the tutorial objectives and are ready to venture out on your own. Expand your ship, build a fleet, gather your crew, carry you to the stars. Choose whether you'll be heroes or villains as you struggle to survive. Or watch your ship become a tomb for other more successful crews to loot. Whatever happens, it's up to you to chart your course. If you find yourself in need of help, you can join the Space Haven community, blah, 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 blah. Okay, got it. Okay, hopefully that's enough. Worst comes to worst, we rip up a couple more things. Is it just this one? Because if it's just this one, I could potentially move it. I guess easy peasy.
Okay, how much for a jukebox? No. I guess I'll dismantle one of the power supply. There we go. But this one is not connected either. No. Because, yeah, if we move that... We've got the, uh... We've got the hyperdrives that we need. All we have to do is just rip these up as soon as we get to the next location. I guess I didn't actually need that other hyperdrive. As much as I thought I did. Well, hopefully in the next system we'll be able to get... ...cracking on making these. How much, how much chemicals do we even... Do we even have? Do I? Oh, I don't have any chemicals. Right, we have the, the raw chemical powder. Okay. I think we're good. There's an unreachable area. Oh, pff, who cares? Okay, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna save. Just because. And let's jump. What does this cost me? 29 here. We cleared out that whole solar system, so bam. Three chambers, everything should be good. Oh, it will just prevent nausea from occurring. So maybe I didn't need that as much as I thought I needed that. go to the sector. I don't know why... Oh. <sighs> Planet has a pirate coalition. Well, I just saved. I guess... Hold up. Let's not prepare. Let's prepare in another manner. Dismantle a couple of these things. Okay, if I go to system, I could get a shield generator. And a shield's console. Not a lot of space around here, which kind of sucks. Here, let's... Dismantle these lights. They're currently in my way. So I'm thinking, if we got shields... It won't be pretty, we gotta make a bigger bridge. I might honestly... Yep. Okay, we're good. We might honestly want to... Can I move these? No, they have to be empty before I can move them. No, so we'll use that. I was going to say we might actually want to have that be the bridge and start trying to design this as a proper thing, but nah. Needs a matching console. But yeah, I figure if I can have one person running the shields to keep my ship from getting shot to hell, we can potentially just raid the other ship. We're certainly loaded for guns. Okay, so I'm gonna just have her boost her shields up before I wanna go anywhere. It'd be nice if I had enough for an energy turret, but we do not have the requisite resources. Okay, so we got shields now. 
That's a that's a good place to be. Okay. Go here. Yeah, it looks like no matter what, we're gonna have to deal with this. Well. You're being interrupted. Evade? Evade. Evasion successful. Well, we don't even know if there's anything there. We don't know if there's any uh, anything on any of these. But does this area just suck? Well, I just saved. Let's see if we can let's see if we can raid these guys and get what we can. I'm almost wondering if this is a weird pirate stopover. Okay, so Lulu is our Ah, eh, screw it. Let's just take everybody. Because Lulu, you are undrafted. Alaric, I I guess our shuttle only has four. So I got I got some shields. Lulu, you are undrafted. Get on those shields. You're drafted. Boarding party. Luckily, they will not take up my shuttle, it looks like. Lulu. Okay. Is trying her best. What do we got in here? I see no pirates. Wait, question. Where's their gun? Guns in the back. This didn't work. Okay, let's load back. The problem is, none of them will move to shoot around things. And so they all just kind of did nothing. Alright. I think we can do that. We just need them to not be complete morons. I think next time we gotta sit stand in the center of the room and let them come to me. I was gonna try and break the gun. Oh, they just bailed. Well, there was nothing in that area anyway, so now they're just going to flee from me. There's more pirates. Chance to evade? That's fine. We're dropping out of hyperspace. They're getting murdered. If we can manage. Okay. I guess I probably should have actually had... All of them up. That's fine. Okay. Everybody... Draft in the shuttle. Next time I'm having them in the shuttle to begin with. There's the pirates on Q. Okay, their gun is in here. I guess I can't shoot their gun. Okay. 
Okay. That's confusing. Goodbye. We have prisoners now. This is obviously a bit rough. Hey, they didn't even get through my shields. So that works out. So I think we might want to scrap the shields next for some guns and turn the ship derelict. We might be able to wreck some other things, but I, I don't I don't know how any of this works. Is it seriously just those guys? Or now we can salvage it. Okay. Let's undraft. Undraft. So yeah, I just had to I had to explore the whole ship. So we got a shit ton of guns. Good stuff too. We want the assault rifles. The shotguns are nice, but they're kind of bad at range. Uh let's see, what do they have on them? Eh, they got they got decent stuff. And since their ship is pretty whole, we get all their things. So that's, that's the answer. That's how we were supposed to salvage that pirate ship earlier. Yeah, I was expecting a lot more than that. But yeah, so we're probably going to be cannibalizing a lot of pirate ships. If I can manage it. Okay. Uh, next order of business. I've got a couple of hull blocks. Let's go back to that. Um, build hull. Where do I want to have the bridge? Where do I want to have the sleeping quarters? I guess I'm going to dismantle an amount of these things. Maybe. going to change the design slightly. I'm going to have kind of a two-pronged bridge situation. is not really much of a hull bridge. Grab those. Oh, does that just give me more hull scrap? It might. I guess I didn't need to de delete quite as much as I did there. Let's see. Do you know if having a separate room to sleep in improves the mood? No. Uh, it actually doesn't. So, the only thing your people care about is whether or not there's a mood boosting something or other. In vicinity. I'm gonna want to get the recycling block. Down sooner than later. All right, we also had that separate derelict. We got two, nice. Only fear is we're gonna run out of water, but I guess that's not a big deal. We've got a fair bit of food. We should be able to grab what we need out of this. But yeah, so uh, it actually, to some small degree, uh, is worthwhile. 
If these guys are next to the oxygen generator, they don't like that. I'll work on it. Uh, but so, like, the kitchen, for example, provides 10 happiness. The jukebox provides 20. So, what you could potentially do... Oh. We got pirates coming in. I should probably save. Hopefully the pirates will have food for me. Okay, where's this? There it is. That shield generator is massively important. Wait, what? Why are you doing that? Okay. So, we have new prisoners. Let's see, is anybody terribly wounded? No. Okay. So let's undraft all of these guys. Undraft this shuttle. So now we have another derelict ship. Well, they have food on them. And medicine and some supplies. Let's transfer all of those. Go back to this. Let's not transfer the dead bodies, because we kind of don't need them. 